and Russ Carnahan, this may take the cake. Russ, and I, you know, you might be able to take the combined IQ of the Carnahan family, and it wouldn't equal the pencil eraser. I'm telling you, these people, this is just hilarious. This is, this is Monday at Forest Park Campus, St. Louis Community College in St. Louis. Representative Russ Carnahan, Democrat, Missouri, held a town hall meeting to talk about health care reform. Here is a portion of his remarks. The overall cost of the package has been estimated at about a trillion dollars over 10 years. About half of that comes from savings and efficiencies in the system. Part of that has Congressional Budget Office... Oh, hold, on a minute, hold, on, hold, hold, on, hold on a minute. Now, re that. They laughed. They laughed when Russ Carnahan said the, the estimated cost is a ten is a trillion dollars over ten years, and about half of that comes from savings and inefficiencies. Now, do you know who first said inefficiencies? Obama. He misspoke. He meant to say efficiencies. They had to rush out a correction from the White House, and they said everybody knew what he meant. Russ Carnahan didn't get the memo. Russ Carnahan stuck with inefficiencies. Here's, uh, here it is, from the top. The overall cost of the package has been estimated at about a trillion dollars over 10 years. About half of that comes from savings and inefficiencies in the system. Part of that has Congressional Budget Office most recently uh, came out and uh, analyzed the current plan and said that it was not only deficit neutral, which has been one of the important factors for the president and congressional leaders, but also that over 10 years it would create a $6 billion surplus. So <laughs> the They're laughing at him. They know more than he does. They're laughing at their congressman. They're laughing at their Democrat congressman at Forest Park campus of the St. Louis Community College in St. Louis. Here's another portion of this town hall. When you have the larger pools, uh, we also have the ability to spread and shrink those administrative costs. So that a larger portion of our health care dollar is actually going to treating the patient as opposed to administrative costs. Novel concept. But uh, it's a very important part of, of creating those larger pools. It's so good, why does the Congress have um, if it's so good, why doesn't Congress have to be on it? Uh, as I said earlier, the health plan, well, we, we hear about the health plan that Congress has. It's not government run. It is a smorgasbord of choices. It's paid for by us, but it's not government run. They have private sector health coverage. Don't they, they, everybody misunderstands this. They think it's a government run program. It's not. These clowns are the government, and they would no more entrust their health care to each other than they would entrust their lives to each other. But they'll put us in the system. Their health care, after Obamacare gets done, will continue to be private sector health care. They're not opting into this. Their health care is not government run. All right, let's go back. So Russ Carnahan got laughed at. They're ridiculed by his own constituents. 